take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. So yes, compared to Bluetooth specs to date, the optical will be of better quality. Neither will be as good as HDMI cable, which allows 8 channels at 192 kHz sampling and 24 bits sample to be transferred, uncompressed. Make your mark, take our lead. The best way to connect a soundbar to your TV is through the HDMI input, 1. Not only can it process Dolby Digital technology for clear sound, but it's also the one that comes with the cheapest cables, and it's very easy to use. So if you're after the clearest audio you can get, HDMI is the way to go. Take our lead. HDMI versus Bluetooth for soundbar sound quality. The best way to connect a soundbar to a TV is through HDMI because it not supports higher bit streams but it's also the most stable. Bluetooth is good enough for playing music from your phone or watching simple YouTube videos but the quality is not the best. Make your mark, take our lead. If your TV supports ARC connections, it means you can connect all your kit, set top boxes, games consoles, etc., to your soundbar, then just use a single HDMI cable to connect your soundbar to your TV. Take our lead. So Bluetooth, like MP3 files, relies on audio compression, in this case a type called SBC, short for, Low Complexity Suband Coding. Compressing audio means it can fit through a smaller pipe, but at a point it also means losing some of the audio content. The upcoming Bluetooth 5 should be faster still. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.